the origin of the Saint Bernard. This breed is directly descended from the Tibetan Mastiff. A very long time ago, this Asian dog was used by the Romans to invade the territory currently occupied by Switzerland. The monks of the Grand Saint Bernard Hospice selected these dogs around the 12th century to help them rescue people in the mountains and to guard the premises. A growing interest in the breed developed as the exploits of Barry and other Saint Bernard dogs were publicized around the world. It is reported that canine enthusiasts began to take an interest in them around 1864 and the breed was officially recognized in 1887. Until about 1830, all dogs of the breed had short hair. It was the introduction of Newfoundland blood into the genetics that created a long-haired variety. The temperament of the Saint Bernard. The Saint Bernard is a benevolent and protective dog towards his family. Despite its impressive size, it is a very sociable dog that gets along very well with children. He likes other animals if we could get him used to it as soon as possible. The Saint Bernard is also very intelligent and calm but he shows a guardian attitude. Malicious people will be quickly put in order because he protects his territory. Loneliness is very difficult to live with for this breed. When left to himself too often or too long, he tends to become depressed, even to adopt a destructive temper. Try to give her love and time. He likes to have his own space. You must reserve a small corner, but not too small for him in your residence.